Hey y'all, welcome back. I am the Backwoods Modeler. You are in my workshop now. Um, hope you see some trucks and something you might like and make you want to come back. All right, <clears throat> so what I have done this week, um, I have a couple of trucks that are still under, under construction here. Uh, I have one that I just finished. So I just want to go over those real quick for you. Um, sorry, probably going to be another quick, short video, but um, we'll see how this goes. So, uh, first one, uh, if any of you guys follow me at all, I've built this truck probably a dozen times now. Um, mostly because this is one of my favorite ones that uh, green light has popped out. Um, this one I decided to leave the camper on, so let's take this off just so I can show you a little better. Um, I went back did the uh, traditional me i put a push bar on the front um i am just about completely well i am completely out of the ford mirrors or ford dually mirrors so i had to put chevy mirrors on this one which you know i still think it looks good on here um we lifted it up i put the um m2 wheels and tires on here um i like these slots or the i don't know if you call them slots but I like this wheel and tire combo that uh, M2 has. Uh, one of my favorites. You, uh, these are mostly on their Broncos. Um, so that's usually where I steal these from. Um, this one, I added a tow hitch to it. Um, what else we do? Uh, painted the bottom of it. Blacked it all out, which I think they should do, but typically they don't. Um, other than that, that's just about all we did to it. One of these days, I'm going to do one of these with some cab lights on it, uh, like I did the white one that I built, but I just haven't done one yet. So, that is that one. Like I said, if you've seen me, uh, been following me a little while, you see I've built that truck a dozen times. All right, now to the ones in progress. This one um, is 86 Chevy. Um, was the Indy 500, official Indy 500 truck, whatever. Um, I wiped that off the door, took the Indy 500 sticker off of there too. Well, it wasn't a sticker, it was a decal. Um, I like that Chevy truck decal on there, so I left that. I left the bow tie on the roof. Um, these are just uh, stock Chevy wheel that they chromed, so I put those on there. I know that the the Goodyear's aren't exact, exactly perfect, but that's what I have. Um this one, believe it or not, I actually put uh, Dodge Ram mirrors on it. Uh, they don't look too awful bad. But again, I'm actually running low on Chevy mirrors now, believe it or not. So I just put on there what I had, and I thought these looked pretty good. This one did not have a tow hitch, um, but I added one. I just so happened to have the perfect one for it. So that's on there. Um, we're going to black the bottom of this truck out also. Um, you can see where I put the axles on there where I lifted it. So, like I said, this is still a truck in progress. I'm going to black out the bottom. Um, I'm thinking on painting the mirrors chrome just because I prefer that over red or leaving them black. So we're going to change that. And then that truck should be ready to roll down the road. So... Next truck that I am building, um, <clears throat> I took my 78 F-250. They already had the camper on it. And what I did is I lifted this one. Again, I used the same Bronco wheels and tires from M2. Those, those I think, look good on these 79 Fords. Um, again, I had to use the Chevy mirrors on this one. Um, I think they're even better because... You can see them on both sides of the camper. So they make good tow mirrors. Um, this one I am also going to put a push bar on the front. And I also have this winch that I'm going to make fit, hopefully, right inside this push bar. It's going to take some modifications, but the plan is to get it to fit inside of there. And still make it look good and fit on the truck so again that's truck in progress um, I think it looks pretty good um, I think these look good when you lift them 
and then with the camper on here it's going to look real nice i'm also going to try to find a ladder that i can put on the back here i have a couple of um, roof racks that came off some off-road trucks that i've built in the past so i would like to put that on there too and we'll see how that goes um again guys i if you can't tell i changed my lights around again um, trying to get that perfect angle. I don't know how some of these guys do it. I'm finding it almost impossible. I have one, two, three, five lights going here, and it still looks dark. So bear with me, guys. I'm working on this. So, all right. I hope y'all had a good day, had a good week. Um, it's been hot up here this week, so hopefully it's a little cooler where y'all are. Y'all have a good day, and uh, I'll catch you back here. Uh, if you like this content, don't forget to uh, like, subscribe, follow me on Instagram, and y'all come back. Y'all have a good day. Bye.